Hey guys, it's Caroline, career and leadership coach. And today I want to talk about a new feature LinkedIn has, the green badge. So uh, the green badge is uh, when you're actively looking um, for jobs, you can change on LinkedIn the way your profile picture uh, looks just by adding a green badge uh, by by changing some of the settings. Now, what I want to do in this session is show you, because I'm a very visual person, so I want to show you what that looks like. So here is my screen. And so what happens is when you look at your profile, um, you will see that you have a section where you can show recruiters you're open to work. And so when you click on that and you add a title, so for me, it would be um, a coach, and um, so head coach and so uh sydney i'm immediately available now ideally you want to add some more titles so as many titles as you can i believe you're limited to a certain amount but that's what you want to do add for the positions that you want to be considered for uh you then say like you look you're flexible and casually browsing so that you actually are not actively actively looking but more passively looking or that you're looking uh straight away that's what you enter here and then the job types that you're interested in and then you have here an arrow and that's where the magic happens is where you can choose between share with all LinkedIn members or share with recruiters uh, only. So if you press that, you will see that um, your profile has now that green banner. So let's go ahead and you will um, you will see that you will have that green layout added to your um your profile and also like that you're looking for head coach roles so that's basically it and this is how it looks so i'm just going to of course uh add it that that i'm no longer uh, open for opportunities and that's how you do that of course now a couple of questions that people are really really interested in uh, in finding out is how is that going to affect my searchability because the whole reason we want to do this is to increase our visibility based uh, on the on the network so let's have a think about how it all works so linkedin uh, has a platform called LinkedIn Recruit that people can buy. Um, so people like recruitment agencies or companies direct can buy that platform. And it's quite an expensive platform uh, to look for talent and to use all the search functions and to basically like filter down, find the right people, post jobs and so on. So it's a really good process and a really good system for people to have, but it's quite expensive. And when they do that, when a company invests to find candidates on the LinkedIn database or in the, on the LinkedIn platform, they will have the ability to find those candidates that indicated and toggled on that uh, little thing of like, I let recruiters know that I'm open for opportunities. That's what people can search on that have access to LinkedIn recruit. So they cannot find you just by your profile picture. So it's only that functionality about, um, um, so those people that have LinkedIn recruit that can find you um, when you actually put toggle on that setting from uh, looking for work or open for new opportunities. However, and this is where it's so important and becomes so relevant for you guys is because if you are a recruitment agency or a company internal and you use LinkedIn to look for candidates and to post jobs, but you haven't invested in the LinkedIn recruit platform. So this is just like that you use the platform, the, the, the LinkedIn um, uh, platform, but not the LinkedIn recruit to find those candidates. You cannot search on who's available and actively looking or not. So you don't have that search filter. It's just like you and I, and you, you, um, when you do a search on LinkedIn, you come up with certain candidates. And so with this new feature, those people that might be using LinkedIn to search for candidates, but haven't invested in the LinkedIn recruit 
platform, they might uh, be able to spot you. So you increase your visibility that way. Now, what is really important here is, of course, you have to be very comfortable that you want to expose your profile like this in terms of like making it very known to everybody, not only in your network, but everybody that will see you, uh, your profile, that they know that you're actively looking for work. I know, for, for example, some people might not be 100% comfortable with that. And so I just want you to be aware of there is that choice and that, that thin thin line that you have to make that choice that's really suited for, for you. But it's an exciting new feature that gives a lot of opportunity, a lot of uh, opportunity to increase your visibility for people that are actively, actively looking and that are saying like, look, I want to go all in, increase my visibility. And that is a great tool for to capture people that use the platform LinkedIn Recruit, but also for people that use LinkedIn as a platform to find talent, uh, but don't have that license that LinkedIn has to use the search functions. Hope this makes sense to all of you. If it doesn't, private message me and say like, hello, can you just explain this again? Because you waffled a little bit and that is fine. <laughs> Sometimes I do that. Uh, I hope I didn't do that in this video. Uh, but and if we are not connected and if you just come across this video and you like what I'm saying and what, what I'm saying is resonating with you, just connect with me on the platform. Um, I believe the more people I can reach and the more people I can really uh, um, and help with their job search and their career, uh, the better, because that's my mission in, in my job. And that's how I get my fulfillment. Uh, I have a signature program. If you're really stuck and you want to get unstuck in your job search and finally learn how to navigate uh, the whole process of job searching and positioning yourself in the market really as an obvious candidate and know how to open those back doors to companies, know how to stand out in, in interviews and really nail them because it's so important that that once you get an interview that you know how to influence and navigate that from a uh, from that perspective. And finally, how to negotiate the best offer uh, so you don't really undersell yourself, so, you, so that you don't push the other person away and the employer away, but that you really understand like how this whole mechanism of job searching works please reach out to me i'm more than happy i will pop a link below this video so you can find out a little bit more about what working together would look like perfect thank you so much i hope this was helpful and i will see you in the next live see ya